Hey everyone, Kelly Noble Mirabella here, and in this video, I'm going to show you how to multi-stream to multiple platforms, multiple destinations using Restream, but I'm going to do it through Ecamm. Now, I am a Mac user. I love Ecamm. I've been using it for quite some time, and it just makes my life a lot easier when it comes to producing my shows. But I also love Restream because Restream allows me to multi-stream or stream to various destinations, which I'm obviously a big fan of. So I'm going to show you how you can accomplish this. First thing we need to do is go over to Restream and we need to set up the destinations. Where do we want to live stream? And then we also want to set up our title and descriptions and everything so that when we hit that go live button, it's going to already put it all out and populate that. So let me show you on screen. All right, so this is the main dashboard when I log into Restream. And I actually go here to add my channels. I've already added all my channels, but I'll show you really quick how easy it is. I go in here, you can see these are all the channels lots and lots and lots of channels that you can go live to. And then these are the premium things that we can do if you have a professional account. So I can go live to public pages, I could do custom, a couple other places. So there's a lot of places that you can live stream. Once you have that set up, it's gonna look like this. So these are all the channels that I have connected. So you, you accept permissions, you're already set up, and you see these little tickers. These are the places that I wanna go live for this broadcast. So usually these would all be either turned on or doing different things. And I went in and I thought, where do I want to go live? I want to go live on my main business page. Yes. Do I want to go live in this group? No. Do I want to go live on this YouTube channel? No. So I'm just going to go through here and pick where I want this content to go out when I do go live. And there we go. So that's how I want it. Now we're going to go to update titles and it's going to take us to this page. Now on this page, we're going to add our title up here for our live broadcast. And if you're live broadcasting to YouTube, this is going to be your title. So you might actually want to use a tool like TubeBuddy. Um, let me show you really quick. This is awesome. We're going to go to YouTube really quickly. I use this really great tool with TubeBuddy to do all of my research uh, for my titles. So you have this little guy right here and we go to tools, keyword explorer, and this one let's say is about we're gonna explore. Now it's gonna give me a score and it says it's pretty good. Uh, I'll weight it on my channel, 46. I mean, that's not horrible. The search isn't super big, but there's no competition. And I would obviously play around with this. So I could say uh, live broadcasting or multi-streaming would be another one. So I'm just gonna test various different ones here. And once I'm happy with the one I'm gonna do, and I'm actually gonna go with live streaming for this one. It's the one and I could take as much time, but since it's a tutorial, we're gonna move on. We're gonna add that as our title, live streaming with Ecamm and Restream. And then you'll put your description here. Now, my, my advice is to write your description somewhere else, and that's exactly what I'm going to do. All right, so I'm just gonna paste this in here. The reason I do this separately is once I hit this update all button, it's gonna update every platform. But then I'm gonna think, oh no, I forgot to put my affiliate link in. And once I do that, I, the only way to edit it, I can't edit all at the same time as a bulk. I have to go in and individually edit each one of these. So I find it just faster for me to go back to my little note where I kept the description, you know, add my little note about the affiliate link or whatever I wanna change, copy it again, and insert it again. So just so you know, that's how I do it. Then once you have this set up, you've updated your titles, you've turned on the channels you wanna go live to, then we head over to Ecamm. You ready to go live? Great, this is your Ecamm. Let me go ahead and shrink this down so it's not distracting. We are going to look at the destination here. Now you can go live to Facebook, Periscope, Twitch, YouTube, custom keys and switchboard, and you can also record. I like to use Restream, obviously I love Restream. Restream. I like to multi-stream. So I just click Restream. Now, if I were to click on this little pencil to edit my description, it would actually take me over into Restream again. It's gonna open in a browser and do exactly what I already showed you. So we're not gonna worry about that. At this point, we're ready to go live. We're gonna click this go live button. I'm not gonna do it right now because I don't actually wanna go live, but we're gonna click this go live button. We'll go live. Up here at the top, we'll be able to see how many people total out of all the destinations are tuning in. And in our comments, we're gonna be able to see who's commenting from various destinations, which is really cool. And when you're 
you're ready to stop, you'll see a button that says end broadcast and you'll end your broadcast. So as you can see, it's actually really easy to set up and utilize Restream with Ecamm. Do you need Ecamm to use Restream? No. Do you need Restream to use Ecamm? No. Ecamm is there to make producing high quality live broadcasts easy. If you're a Mac user, it's fantastic. If you're a PC user, unfortunately, it's not available to you. Restream is there to multi-stream to lots of destinations at once or more than one destination at once. Maybe you have two. It's up to you and it makes it super easy. Now you can use Restream to live stream on their platform. You can go to the browser, you can live stream, but if you want to use Ecamm along with it, I just prefer Ecamm for that, for kind of producing, then you can absolutely do that and I just showed you how. So if you'd like to check out Restream for yourself, please do. I have a link down in the description. You get 15% off. You can absolutely try it for free if you wanna check out just the, the one stream option just to get a sense for the bells and whistles or you can snag that offer that I have with my affiliate link down below. I hope that you found this helpful. Please consider subscribing, liking, commenting, and I will catch you next time. It is Vlogmas, so I'll catch you tomorrow with another tutorial. Thanks, have a great day.